Good morning everyone. Just wanted to give you a little tip on how to make uh, juicing affordable. Uh, my daughter and I both want to juice at the same time so it could get a little expensive. Not sure how long I'm going to be doing it. Uh, my daughter's probably going to do it for what 15 days Erica? Mm -hmm. For about 15 days but I'm going to try and push it even longer. Now we needed a good juice fast. We tried to do a couple of juice, uh, juice fast not long ago myself did not succeed because when I'm making food for you guys, it's hard not to taste. So this time, if we both do it, less cooking, I'm going to be able to pull it off again. So I just want to show you, we've got green apples. I've got one bag here, another bag of green apples. Uh, and I'm going to tell you that this wasn't really expensive. We've got some... Erica, do you want to give me a hand look? We've got some limes. Now, I've got more limes. I've got another 10, 12 limes um, already in... Um, I have it in the house, but we bought more because we're going to put a lot of these limes in our juices. And we're going to go for the healthiest juices possible. We're not going to go for all those fruity juices. We're going to try and have a lot of green juices so we went for the cheapest and the most simple way to juice so we've got lemons limes we've got ginger you can tell these aren't organic right this is <laughs> the perfect time to juice too the spring i know and it, we're going to get ready for the spring so we could go you know mountain climbing and whatever else my daughter loves doing we've got some celery really cheap and this time, I did not do the organic, guys. Normally, we try to do the organic, but this time we did not do the organic because it's going to cost us way too much money to juice, especially the amount of time we're juicing. We've got kale here, carrots. We've got two bags of carrots, plastic bags. My husband, I, unfortunately. And even and the cucumber I, comes wrapped in And plastic. the cucumber, and I got mad at my husband, but... He's well, trying. There's no, this is how it comes in the He's store. trying. He says it comes that way. The apples he picks separate. As you can tell, he's got my bags. But the carrots, he bought the bags. So he was, I put it this way, he wasn't happy when I when he came home because we sent him out, uh, out today. I did tell him, don't get bags, get a box. So he came home with the box. I was happy about that. Uh, but yeah, he picked the cucumbers and the plastic. I wasn't crazy about that. But I think basically these English cucumbers all come in plastic now. Very, very few places have them with uh, without the plastic. They, they shrink wrap Yeah, they do shrink wrap it. So, but where he went today, this is what he came home with. And we have a so, honeydew. And we have a honeydew, yes. But we do have stacks of oranges and that we can juice. And I will be sending them out for some tomatoes because I'm going to do some V8 type of uh, juices. But look at this. Look at all the food we got here. And if I tell you we paid, I think it was what, 40 45 46 $45 for all of this. And that's a lot. We're talking kale. We've got carrots, cucumber, uh, cantaloupe. I feel so bad because of, after all that preaching I did, and I still have to train him. I got to train my husband. He's got to learn where to go and get stuff that doesn't have the packages. This is driving me nuts. These bags right now is like a thorn in my foot. I see this and I just want to scream bloody murder. Anyhow, we're, we're going to let it go now because I'm not going to ruin my day. But here it is. We've got two bundles of kale, canta, uh, honeydew, two bags of carrots. Not the biggest bags, but... They will do. We've got cucumbers. We've got two, and I lost the celery stick. We've got two bundles of celery and two large bags of apples. Look how many apples in this bag. There, look at that. Not bad, eh? Two big bags of apples. We've got lemons, limes, and ginger. And this was $47, $45, $47. So, and this is for me and Erica. If this is just for one person, you would be good for a long, long time. But I just wanted to show you that it is easy to be able to juice and go on a juice fast. You could do it cheaply and not as, not as bad as 
some people think. A lot of people say, I can't do it. Well, yeah, if you're buying strawberries and berries to juice, they don't juice. But I know people that do put them in juice. No, it's not. Number one, it doesn't... It doesn't juice properly. It doesn't juice properly. It juice ends well. up going into... You get the fiber with that. Yeah. It ends up just turning into the mush. Yeah, so now all I'm waiting for is the tomatoes. We do have some peppers at home, so we don't have to worry about that. We do have onions, so I don't have to worry about that. So everything else we have... So, not bad. This is a good start. This is going to last us for a while. And I could do another video telling you how long this is going to last us. And, um, but you know, at this point, is it worth your health to be able to spend the money that you do to do a juice fast? I say it is worth it. And, um, yeah, it's just so, uh, it's so great. What you feel after a juice fast is what we were talking about yesterday, my daughter and I. How amazing do you feel after a juice fast? And if you can do a long one, I say do a short one. But you should tell them to uh, watch that so you can nearly do Oh yeah, that's true. Um, if you For want to, who haven't really yeah, if you've never done a juice fast and you want to get that encouragement. Uh, there's a documentary called Fat, Sick, and Nearly Dead with Joe Cross on Netflix. On Netflix, free to watch. Uh, he's pretty amazing. Yeah, let I me think show they you. Even have it on we do have oranges. Uh, we do have some tomatoes, we have more limes, so it's not that we're running out of stuff, we have it. Um, I wanted a jicama, and I didn't get the jicama because my husband didn't even know what it was. He calls me up, he says, what's a Jamaica? <laughs> so, I gave up on that. So, I pretty much gave up on that when he told me that. So, there you go. Anyhow, we're going to start a juice fast. I'm going to try. I did one for 60 days. Do I want to do another one for 60 days? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I would love to. I would love to. But I'm going to push. I'm going to push as hard as I can push. And maybe I'll document some of my uh, juice fasting and see what what I'm up to. Um, made some more kimchi, guys. See, now this is a problem because I made kimchi and I won't be able to eat it. This is going to drive me batty. This is day two fermenting. And yeah, beautiful kimchi. Look at that. Eee, I'm excited. Well, this is not going to go bad on me. That I know for sure. So there you go, guys. I hope you like this little video and my little rant on plastic because this, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm not going to sleep tonight because of this. This is going to drive me crazy. But so far, here it is. We're starting to juice fast. If anybody else wants to join, I might post this on uh, my page. If you guys want to join, come join us and let us know your progress on how you're doing with your juice fast. We're starting on Monday, so if you have to pick up any stuff, any vegetables, pick them up now. And uh, starting Monday, we could all juice together. I'm aiming for longer than 15 days. I'm going to try 30, if not more. But my daughter is going to do it for 15 because she said she doesn't want to turn to a little twiggy either. Because she's not a big girl, so... Not that I'm big, but I could shed a couple of pounds these days. <laughs> but there you go. Hope you like this little video, guys. And guess what? Happy juice fasting if you are. And I'll see you in my next one. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawsome Kitchen. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.